Hello and welcome to Chili Bee Gaming. I'm Evie and today we're back with some more Cataccio Laboratories Chapter 2. So let's get into it. Alright, yes, we made it here last time to, what's it called? Revisitation. One slime ball, nine levers. Nine? Wow, that's a lot of levers. Um... Okay, so... Right. So we can get our... S well, yeah, we can get our slime ball. That's not a problem. Um... What's up here? Okay, let's just... just. Ooh, okay, oh. Right, so we obviously need... Something to... The slime ball and the the um, arrow to open that. Seven outside, two inside. This lever is one time use. You can pick it up. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, so we get to... Okay, never mind. And then obviously this is back uh, down. Okay, yep. So... Nine levers. Um. Huh. Just thinking how we'd get the slime ball out, because. Oh, maybe up there. But then, uh. So we need a lever for that. Clearly. Do you suppose? Do you suppose? Would we need... Would we need the levers from here? Maybe? Well, we can pick them up. We might as well take them. Why not? Okay. Um, Alright, so we've got two levers. We need one for here. There we go. Oh, um, whoa! Oh, okay. Um, do we maybe have to just kind of launch ourselves backwards? Okay, no. Okay. There you go. Did it, did it, did it. Yeah, so we could maybe fit the slime up here. Maybe I could reach. And then we need what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight levers. Out of levers, try retracing your steps. You might find some you already used. Who knows? Just a, I'm just a sign. Yeah. All right, just a sign. Well, okay. Let's um. Well, we'll we'll take this lever with us just just for now. Um. All right, well, I guess maybe we could fire ourselves across there. Okay, yep. To get our slime, that's fine. So, if I do that, could we? Could we put our slime up there, I suppose? Um, maybe, oh, yes, we could. Hey, hey, perfect, all right. And then I can launch myself. Oh, mind you, I'll need the slime, won't I? To open this door. Um, crumbs. Let's get the slime again. Get the slime again. Okay. Ugh. What? Oh, of course. Ouch. All right. So... Poof, and put the ball, slime ball in there. Okay. Three levers. <sighs> hmm. But the three levers gets us... Oh, wait. Um. Do we now need to put the slime through? I think maybe that's the case. Just guessing here. 
this is all guesswork. I could be completely wrong, but I don't know. Maybe. Um, okay. Yep, there you go. So that's that sorted. If we stand here, we can launch ourselves back over. Poof. Thank you. Right, so the slime's up there. That's fine. We've got three levers. So, assumedly now... Unless you were supposed to lock now, well, maybe we'll, we'll we'll figure it out. Oh, good God! Oh, we probably need the slime. Oh God, honestly, failing, failing, failing at life. Okay, okay. just to, oh. Mm. Okay, let's just test the theory here. Hey, hey, that works. That bloody well works. All right. So we've got the slime. Then we can go up. Oof. Uh, this way. Slime ball there and there. Okay, we've got another lever. Thank you. All right, so we now have four, I think we need five for there. Um, okay, so we've got four levers. Ooh, can I, thank you. So four levers, did I leave one here? No. Um. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Well, I, hmm. Okay. Um. Let's. Ow. God bless it. So. Oh yeah, there's the previous test chamber. Cool. Is there is there like anything else here? Any other? Oh hello. I see a door. I see a door. What? Oh, what's all this scrambled? Scrambled. The left side, the right side. The duality of of PJs. I okay. Um. Hmm. All right. Ooh, what's this? Ah, <gasps> it's a little hidey hole. Okay. Uh, ooh. Chamber twelve. Something. A trato. Pass. I don't know. Ooh, another head. Hello, head. I don't know if we're supposed to do anything with the heads, but. Oh, hello. What the hell? Operation Netheria. The symbol on the wall in blood red is a symbol used by the Ombra factories, which was provided to us by an insider. While we're still unsure as to what it means, we know it has to do with their recent Netheria project that was leaked on Reddit. All right. Um, okay. Seems a little weird, but fine. Um, test chamber decommissioned. Test chamber 12 observatory. Oh, yeah, because this is where they'd sit and watch, obviously. Oh. How weird. Ooh, strange. Okay. Um, well, let's just get out. That was enlightening, I think. Can we? Could we? Do you suppose maybe... I think we can get onto another test tra tra 
track there, can't we? Because we've gotten the levers from this. Can we... Do you know what? Let's go up. Ow! One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we need six and we only have four. So, can we... Oh, God! There we go. Okay. So... Aha! Look at that! Alright, and then assumedly we can fire ourselves back up onto the onto the top of this somehow. Hopefully. <laughs> oh god. Be a bloody bloody pain if we couldn't. Um ah, maybe we can fire ourselves up there. If we Yes, look at that. All right, so we can go up here and open this now. That's fine. Bam. Ooh. Not a fan of, of that. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. It's a lot of levers. Jeez, Louise. Ha-ha. Look at this. And then the ninth. Hey. So... How do I get back through, though? All right, so... Assumedly, then, we'll need these levers. Yep. Little lever bros. Okay. So now we have... We have the nine levers we need. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. All right, so now can I... Oof! Could we... Maybe we could hit that from... Possibly. We'll try. Eep. Uh. Hey, we did it! Awesome, awesome, awesome. And then... Up there. Oof! Oh! Ow! Alright. Never mind. It's fine. It's all fine. It's all good. So... Yeah, this way. Hey! Look at that! Brilliant! Okay, so now we just need... The slime. The slam. Um... Oh, I was thinking, how did I do this? And it's like, that's how you did it, stupid. <laughs> what a fool. All right. So I think if I... Oof. Oh, God, really? Bloody hell. Could... Yeah. I think this is how we need to... Yeah. Did that good? Yes, it did. Brilliant, brilliant. And then fire ourselves back over there. Boom! Okay. Through this way. To this. Hey! We might have cracked it here, folks. Okay. If I could... Okay. Yep. 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 If I could do this right, it'd be great, wouldn't it? There you go. And... Slam! Thank you. Okay, so... One... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. And then chuck the slime in. Oh, look at that. Brilliant. Two. Bloody marvellous, you know. That was a tricky one. Tricky one. But we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Did you know lockpick? Legal in 195 countries. Some... Effect plates make the lockpick appear as a toothbrush. All right. The lockpick is genetically modified from the weed whacker. Okay. Um, doesn't actually pick locks. It breaks them. Okay. Won the 2005 Most Destructive Lockpick Award. And uh, update legal in zero countries. Oh, dear. Well. Firewalk. Okay, I think... Catacho quote of the day. If a slime ball falls in a test chamber and no one's around to hear it, does it make the sound of a plate being pressed? Dunno. Alright. Let's rock and roll, buckaroo. Look at this. Play cameras watching all the time. Hello? Alright, last one. Here we go, folks. Hello. 
Congratulations on getting to the final chamber, Test Subject 3. Just like before, you've proven to us that you are the face of the future here at our facility. Now, please don't disappoint us or the people at home by dying during this last test. I mean it. If you die on this last chamber, I'll lose a bet. Oh. And I really don't want to have to keep doing the dumb stuff the lab boys get me to do when I lose bets. Okay. Um. All right, let's have a look. So swap. Obviously need a slime ball there and there, maybe. Or a slime ball and an arrow. So two slime balls, three levers. Okay. Well, what does... Oh, it's not lit up. I see. So will it stay? Okay. Yes, it will. So then, assumedly, we go over there. Whee! All right. So that needs a lever to open those, possibly. Can't go through there. That's just a slime. Can't go through. So what else have we got here? <gasps> um. Yeah. What's... Is there something up there we have to hit, I suppose? Ah, there's a box. So if we... Ah, if we hit that... Do we maybe have to... And then... Oh, I missed. And I fell. So, double jeopardy. So if we wait for this to come back... Did I hit it? Did I hit it? I hit it. Yes! Look at that! Brilliant! Hey, hey! So we've got our first lever. Marvellous. Alright, so now I need to oh, get down, grab my arrow, and we're on our way. Um, missed the wall. Okay, so... Hmm. Do you suppose... Hmm. I think it can only go here, can't it? So... Hmm... What's... Let's just... We can always come back. That's fine. Um... So what's over there? Oop! Ugh. The oh, hey! Another head! Brilliant! Another head! Ah, so we must need a slime for that as well. All right, well, let's let's mosey on back. Ooh, there are ladders here. Why are there ladders here? That's that's a little strange. All right, so maybe maybe take that out. Thank you. So, aha. Okay, um, let's just see here. So how does that turn off, do you suppose? Oh, there isn't a means to turn it off. So, okay. Oh, I mean, oh, wait a minute, let's just... Ah, so if I <clears throat> fire myself up there, ow, so, ah, is there possibly another pad in there? Possibly. Ooh. So if we, must have to be bloody quick about this, maybe. Look at that, eh? Tell you what, bloody genius. Too marvellous, you know? Too marvellous. All right. Don't blindly turn this corner with your slime balls. Well, yeah. I don't have any anyway yet. So, ooh. Maybe up there. 
Aha! Damn it. A little closer, maybe. Aha! Right, so we can... Ah, get our slime ball now. Bing! Thank you. All right, so... Let's just take a peep. Is that something we could use? Maybe over there? I don't... No. Maybe we could... Can we hit it from the edge here? Oh, we can. Hey, look at that. So... Ah. So we need the two slime balls for in here, I imagine. Okay. Um. Well, let's fling ourselves back here. So we don't want to... Ah. All right. Let's just fitting. Thank you. Right. Okay. So then this is where we needed the slime ball, wasn't it? So let's do that. Okay. Through here. To there. Oh. Bing. All right. Um, so if we throw the slime ball onto there. Now the question is. Ah. Can we. Ah. Look at this. Look at this now. Kablam. Freaking did it, baby. Boop. All right, so we need the other slime ball. Lovely. So we obviously need two levers, three, well, two slime balls and our arrow to get across there. That's fine. So if I grab my slime. All right. Okay, back through here. Marvellous. Right, so we've now got our two slimes and our um, lever. So, do we need to go back up there, I imagine, maybe? Haha, uh. -ha, that's how we do it. So, okay, bam. And I think we had to come through here, didn't we? Did we? Let's just have a look. Oh, missed. There we go. All right. So then we got the two slimes. Q and Q. Oh. Brilliant. Brilliant. Okay. Another lever. Marvellous. Too bloody marvellous, actually. So we've now got our two slimes. Um, I think we just need to head back down now. I think. See, we could we do you suppose? Do we need them over there? Let's. We can always get them back because I can go through here. Ah. Yes, we did need the slime balls, didn't we? Um, thank you. All right, so... Oh, really? Come here. So, ah, I see. So we're going to need one for in there. Ugh. Then... There and... There. Haha, -ha, another lever. Marvellous, marvellous. Bloody marvellous. Okay. Um, slam. Uh, thank you. What? Oh. Um, oh, there you go. Marvellous. Great. Okay, so... Wait a minute. Yeah. 
this is the one. What? Oh, we have to stand on it. Ugh. Stupid fool. What does this do then? Oh, it activates that, doesn't it? Oh, hello. Good grief. Right, okay, so I've now got my slams and three levers. Um. Uh, so it was through here, I think, wasn't it? Uh, dee dee dee. Lever. Yep. And then across here. Bing. Missed. God bless it. Okay. Um, and then there. Ah, there you go. Um, then back over here, I think, and then up to there. Poof! Really? Oh! There we go. Poof! Alright, through here. So two levers. Bam. Bam. We can get our other slime back. Oh no, have I put the wrong slime down? I did put the wrong slime down. God bless it. Never mind. Um, we can always go back. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. So slime ball number one, we need to keep hold of. Slime ball number two can go on there. Right, perfect, perfect. And then up there. There you go. Through. There it is. Slime ball number two. All right. So, one, two. Oh. Ah, that opens that. Okay, we need the three, three items here. One, two, three. That opens that. And we're out. Winner's lounge. Out of order. <laughs> Oh. Well, test subject three, I don't know what to be more excited over. The fact that you completed our final chamber, or the fact that I'm finally the winner of a bet! Okay. Yes! You're there, Jeff! Why Hello? are you gone yet? Get out of here! Can I... Hello? <sighs> Congratulations on completing Test Track 9. And feel free to take a moment to relax and celebrate your success in our winner's lounge. Uh, once done, you'll be able to make your way down a couple of hallways until you come across a reward we have set up just for you. Now, I think you're going to like this one a bit more than the one we set up for you after completing Test Track 2. Look forward to it. Look forward to it. Look, look, look. Okay, that sounds fun. Um, test Subject Feedback Portal. Okay, well, okay. Um, all right. Let's uh, let's go then. Okay, what? Hello, test subject. This is an emergency response from the robotic repair group. What? We apologize for the sudden cave-in that has blocked your path from completing the testing track. A team of repair bots will be sent to clean up the mess within the next 24 hours. In the meantime, we will create a detour that will take you outside of the testing track so you can work your way around the collapsed ceiling. The door on the right of the hallway will open in three, two, one. Thank oh. you for your understanding. Okay. Okay. What's this? Daily reminder. The repair bots are only responsible for the testing track. Please clean up your own mess instead of making them do it. Thank you. Dave Cataccio, track 09 general manager. Okay. Fridge. Okay, this is a little weird. What's in here? PC, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, this isn't this isn't weird at all. Okay, so what have we got here? Important notice: the automated employees will be left in the faculty. No, the automated employees will be left in the facility to repair the perpetual testing track, as well as maintain test subjects in cryogenic storage. Please do not interfere with their tasks. 
evac notice due to the catastrophic nature of what's happening on the surface. We are evacuating the facility until further notice. Please follow the Catachio Laboratories high-tech evacuation protocol manual that was given to your project coordinator to share. We should also mention that all test subjects are to remain in cryogenic storage for the time being until the facility is considered safe to return to. This includes Test subject 03 who is in the perpetual testing track. Why do I not like the sound of that? The automated employees have been instructed to keep test subject 03 suspended in test track 09 until facility is back in working condition. Do not reanimate TS test subject 03 under any circumstances. Yeah. Yeah. Wait a minute. Could we have used... Oh no, we can't, can we? I don't think. Can, could I? No, it's closed. Oh, oh god, I'm stuck on the cobwebs. No, can't get back through there. Um. Well, yeah, okay. Guess we have to hop. No, can we not? No, okay. Perpetually stuck in this bloody stuff. Can I? Um. Are there any... Ah, yes, there you go. I can destroy this lever. Give me that. Is there another one somewhere? Clock. No. Um. Well... levers button okay oh <gasps> what's this this place is a joke what okay what? did I find out that they're making Dave Catacho the general manager for test track 09 I can't believe the nepotism in this place first Jake gets his childhood best friend to be his secretary and now he makes his own nephew general manager after only being here for two months, I've been here for 17 whole years and I haven't received any recognition for my faithfulness to the company. To make things worse, the higher-ups have the nerve to mock my newest invention, faucets, that also work as levers. They claim it's impractical and has no real-world applications. Just they wait, because this invention is going to take off one of these days, even if I have to transfer to the Ombra factories in order to do so. Hey! I just clicked on that simply because it was a weird looking colour. But hey, we've got another lever. Got another lever. So we can open this door, maybe. Open up! In the name of the law. Another head? Okay. Fridge. Another lever. Um. Alright. Nope. Take that lever with me just in case, because you never know, do you? You never know. Test track 09, hall 14. Do not enter during testing. Test track general manager Dave Catacho. Okay. Do we maybe have to. Aha, yes, look at this, look at this. Boom! Look at that. Thinking outside the box there this books okay there you go there you go look at that bam all right ah we're back on the other side look brilliant okay new testers reward program yeah congratulations test subjects your Testing reward is up above. Good job and enjoy. Yeah. I don't believe it. What's up here? Slime. Okay. Ow. Yeah. Yeah. 
This feels dodge. Okay. Hello again, test subject three. Now you might notice that you are now standing in the cave where your test track nine journey began. Mm hmm. This is because test track nine isn't just our scenic testing track, it's also our perpetual testing track. You see, building test tracks takes a lot of work, and ever since you've been asleep, we've been doing our best to streamline the testing process. Now that our repair bots can fully repair the testing track, we thought it'd be great to have one that never ended. Once you step back into that cryogenic tank you awoke from, you will be frozen and put to sleep. Now, while asleep, we'll give you a free, and I should mention harmless, memory wipe so that when you wake up after the testing track has been reset, you can go about Test Track 9 all over again with a fresh mindset. This will allow every run of the track to be unique, and it will provide us with new scientific data each time. These messages of my voice you're hearing are pre-recorded, so they should be able to help guide you through the track each time, which saves me a lot of work. I'd also like to thank the folks at home for taking the time to view our perpetual testing track and feel free to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon to make sure you never miss a stream when Test Subject 3 reawakens to complete another round of our testing track. Please feel free to step back into your cryogenic tank, Test Subject 3. We look forward to monitoring your next round of the track when you awaken. Until then, I've been Jake Catacho. Founder and CEO of the Katacho Laboratories. Thank you for testing, and thank you people at home for watching. Goodbye. And as predicted. Well, there you go. There you go. We will leave it there for today, folks. I will step back into this tank once we have finished and be frozen again. But that was Katachio Laboratories Chapter 2. Very enjoyable. A lot of fun. Really enjoyed it. So until next time, be safe, be good, and look after yourselves. Thank you for participating in our perpetual testing track. This has been your 243rd run of this testing track. We look forward to your next round of these tests when you awaken. Good night.